Good day everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about Stellar Toolkit for Outlook. Now, the Stellar Toolkit for Outlook is an advanced 8-in-1 toolkit for Outlook. It is a software package for Outlook users and administrators offering tools to repair corrupt PST file, convert OST into PST, split and compact PST file, and optimize Outlook performance. To download this software, follow the link in the description. Now, once you're on the website, to download the software, click on the free download. Once the software has been downloaded, double click on the executable file. You may see a user access control prompt. You may click on yes or continue on the screen. Now on the screen, you will see a select setup language. Choose the preferred language for the demonstration purpose. I'm going to select English as the preferred language and then click on OK. Click on next. Accept the end user's license agreement, then click on next. On, on the next window, you will be prompted to select the installation location. Now by default, it would be installed in C program files. In case if you want to change the location, you may click on browse and change the location of the installation setup. For the demonstration, I'm going to keep it as is and then click on next. Click on next again. And if you want to create a shortcut on the desktop, keep this box checked and then click on next. Then click on install. This would go ahead and install the Stellar Toolkit for Outlook on your your computer once the installation is complete you will see this window the one which you're seeing on the screen if you want to launch the stellar toolkit for outlook keep this box checked and then click on finish you will see a user access control prompt which you might you have to click on yes or continue on the screen as soon as you click on the yes or allow the tool to access the computer you it will take you to the startup window under this section you will see a couple of options the main screen of stellar toolkit for outlook will give you a couple of options basically it will give you eight different options some of the options what you can see here is repair mailbox convert OST to PST. You can also uh, use this tool to merge Outlook PST file, recover deleted emails, split Outlook PST file or compact Outlook PST file. You can always use this tool to you remove duplicate emails or recover Outlook password. So for the demonstration purpose, I'm going to use repair mailbox. So what I would do is I would go ahead and select the first option which says repair mailbox. Basically, it will repair the corrupt Outlook data file PST or OST uh, for the both. So since I have a corrupt PST file, we are going to repair the corrupt PST file from my computer. So I'm going to choose the first option. Now this window here, you would get a two options here. You will have an option to select the data file from the profile list, or you can choose the data file from the uh, mailbox manually. In my case, I have the corrupt PST file saved under desktop under recovery folder. Uh, let me try to open Outlook and show you uh, the exact error message. So when I try to open the corrupt data file from my computer, this is the error message of what it is giving when I'm trying to expand this folder. It says that the set of folders cannot be opened because the Outlook data file repaired cannot be found. So whenever I try to uh, expand or explore the data, what is in there, this computer, it wouldn't allow me to do it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to close this Outlook data file and then I'm going to run the repair. So I'm going to minimize Outlook or um, what I would also do is I would close Outlook and here uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to run a repair. So uh, I'm going to choose the Outlook data file manually. I'm going to click on browse and then I'm going to go to recovery desktop navigate to the location where i have my corrupt pst file click on open and then click on repair now what this will do is this will try to go ahead and repair the outlook data file and as soon as the repair is complete uh you will have to click on ok now this screen will allow you to uh allow you to preview the data what you have on your outlook data file so this was the data which was which i was not able to open in my outlook and the out stellar repair for outlook allows me to view the data what what is in there in the outlook data file so here you have an option to navigate to contacts calendar and see what data has been present in the computer and you can decide to choose what data to import so just in case if you want to extract or repair one particular email you can also save one email at a time or in case if you want to save the complete data from your corrupt data file what you can do is you can click on save repaired file and uh, you since we are going to export 
or save the complete data from the corrupt PST file. I'm going to select the first option, click on next. And uh, here you would see a couple of options here. So by default, it would say save PST normally. So I'll take that as a default option and then click on next. Now here it gives me a location where I want to save the uh, restored data file uh, on my computer. So by default, I'm going to save it in the same location where I have my corrupt data file and then click on OK. So as soon as the export is complete, you can then try to open the data in your Outlook. So now what we will try to do is we will try to open the repaired data file on my Outlook and see if I'm able to open it. So there are two ways of getting that data into Outlook. Either you can use import export wizard or you can import the, the repaired data file to your existing PST file. In my case, I would prefer to open that data file and check if all the data file is accessible. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on file at the top left corner click on open and export click on open outlook data file and here i would go ahead and choose the location where i have my pst file saved the recovered pst file it's under recovery and then click on outlook data file repaired that's the pst file which has been saved after the repair and then click on ok i will try to expand the recovered or repaired pst file under this you will see a folder which says top of outlook data file expand that folder under this section you will be able to see all the data file the repaired data from my corrupt psd file in my outlook so this is how you can go ahead and uh, recover or repair the corrupt data file from your computer using the stellar repair for outlook beside that stellar toolkit for outlook can be used for a different purpose in case if you want to convert your ost file to psd file this tool will also allow you to do that beside that you can also use this tool to split your outlook data that is psd data or ost data you can also use this data to compact the outlook data file to improve the performance of your outlook you can also use this tool to merge mailbox for outlook in case if you have two different psd files you can use this data file uh, use this tool to merge the PST file in your computer. You can also use this tool to uh, deduplicate your data from your Outlook and also use to undelete email for Outlook. In case if you have deleted emails in your Outlook accidentally, you can use this tool to recover the deleted emails. The best part of this tool is it can also use to restore the password of your Outlook data file. So this is how you can go ahead and use Stellar Toolkit for Outlook on your computer. To check the product, follow the link in the description. I hope this video was useful. In case if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel thank you have a great day